What is going on, everybody? Welcome back again to another live stream. It is currently the 4th of September, 2023. It's the Monday afternoon over here in the... I was all trying to say everybody and everyone at the same time. Welcome back, every bun, apparently. How does the streaming thing work again, guys? I don't know. Do you just talk into a microphone and then uh, wave at the guys in the chat? Is that what you do? I think so. Welcome, everybody. Holiday was really nice. Yeah, I had a really good time. Always good to take a little bit of time and do a whole lot of nothing for about a week. I look like I haven't aged a day since last week. Thank you, man. I'll take that. I'll take that one. Thank you very much. Thank you also, Count Nazgul, for the eight-month resub. I did touch a little bit of grass. Yes, a little bit. Um, not. It's been. It's been yeah. You will recommendation through un. Guys, any good memes on the StarCraft 2 subreddit? Because I haven't seen any of them for like a week. What a crazy time. Let's have a look. Top this week. I'm ready. Each, each race's reaction to enemy attacks. Terran, we need some help here. Zerk, Scree. Protoss, we embrace the glory of battle. True, dude. Each race's reaction to the enemy's attack, the tall the rim. Only destruction awaits our foes. Very nice. Yeah, the protals are very dramatic indeed. Drama queens. All of them. All of them. Bam, bam, bam. I'm actually gonna remove this one and replace it with this. Get a little bit of. Does that make me a bad guy? A sellout? I was digging through unfinished cinematic game files. All of them. I was digging through unfinished cinematic game files and I found this. <laughs> Is that Nova writing a random guy from the Hyperion? Nova writing a random guy from the Hyperion? Okay. Okay. Leaked footage of the inner workings of the Balance Council? Oh god, okay. Let's pause this. Wait, is that supposed to be Horner? That doesn't really look like Horner, am I crazy? Anyways. Footage of the inner workings of the Balance... Okay. Okay. Wait, is that supposed to be Horner? That doesn't really look like Horner, am I crazy? Anyways. What is this? Somewhere on the outskirts of Char. Great. So now that we've solved the catering problem, let's move on to... Still insufficient cheese. Okay, I get it, Abathur. Moving on. Jeez, people. Do you want to be here all day? Fine. We'll get some at Kroger. Yes, I want delicious cheese. So... Next order we'll get what? I have no idea what they want. Anyways. Business. The patch. We've gone too far. Yes. Protoss is too weak. Zerg is too strong. Jeez. We must dial back. Otherwise, the people are- Hello, friends. Oh, God, he's here. <laughs> no, we're not dialing back. Everything is going according to plan. People still think Protoss is OP. We shall continue to secretly nerf them. But Harstam. The forums! Do not worry. Just be patient. Terran is next. Can I have some cheese? Good. Very good. That's a high quality production, dude. I have no idea how you make any of this. That's pretty cool. Leaked video footage of the inner workings of the Balance Council. I don't really want to get into the Balance discussion again, guys. I have been following the Balance discussion from a bit of a distance. And my god, do I not enjoy it. It, it really does remind me of politics. I, I don't know. I feel like we need to have a balanced discussion free stream, but maybe that's not, I don't know, maybe that's not possible. What's this? Four days ago, a UNN presents a special programs on StarCraft II Balance by Donnie Vermillion? Good evening. This is Donnie Vermillion live from the UNN studios on Core Hall. Today we've got a breaking story for you. There was a balance patch announced. <laughs> we'll go now to our reporter, Kate Lockwell. Kate, no! is Protoss still OP? 
Actually, Donnie, it seems people think that Protoss is getting the short end of the stick here. Historically, Protoss has been underperforming. Mate, Protoss is definitely not getting the short end of the... But anyways. And it doesn't seem like Protoss has gotten the buffs necessary to fix... That's right, folks. You heard it here first. Protoss is still overpowered. Sky Toss is a bunch of bullshit and cannon... Sky Toss is a bunch of bullshit and... Bunch of bullshit and cannon rush needs to be removed from the game. Excellent. I'm gonna have to forward this to CTG. I don't think CTG checks out the StarCraft subreddit as often, but maybe I'm mistaken. I don't know. I don't think he really watches for the multiplayer stuff. I think you'll like this. That is really nice. This is what AI was meant for, guys. This is why AI, uh, yeah, it was made. What's going on, Thort? Hello, Lou. The battle cruiser captain after I teleport him onto the target instead of Yamato? No, how do you do that? How did you pull that off? You used the wrong hotkey? Ay, 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 ay. Karas? Barges into the lore, full voice acting. His mastery of sonic powers were considered legendary. I will stand against the Queen of Blades, elaborates <laughs> further, and then dies. Yeah, he does die within about 30 seconds of him appearing in the game, doesn't he? Yeah. Yeah, he does He does disappear pretty much immediately. That's a good meme, I like that one. Is this what the average Protoss player looks like right by the way? Is this, is this the, the average physique of the average Protoss? How do you even get your t-shirt behind your neck like that? How do you- wh what is this piece of clothing that this Giga Chad guy is wearing? How do you even do that? I'm not muscular enough, that's clearly the problem. Thanks, What's up, Integral? Thanks. I miss the loco rambles at the beginning of your USC2 casts. Oh, I've got plenty of those, man. Thank you very much, Integral. Max Pax's real name uncovered when mom calls you by your full name. Maximum Paximum? <laughs> this is a very low effort meme. Very nice. I haven't played a single second of StarCraft 2. Ask me anything. And I will pretend I'm a pro. Oh god. This is literally the entire Reddit already? Yeah! Actually true, dude. How many guys on the subreddit have actually played a game of StarCraft 2 this year? Is it more than 20%? Unlikely. Unlikely. What's going on with us? Thank you so much. Sick. Thank you. That's sick. Why did the three hatch before 21 supply Zerg build? Percent? Why did the three hatch before 21 supply Zerg build go out of style? Because it's too slow, other builds are more efficient? I mean, other builds are more efficient, yes. Is it too, too slow? The reason why triple hatch before pool fell out of style, uh, fell out of style is because literally going hatch gas pool is better as far as like, Worker count goes. It feels like going triple hedge before pool is faster with workers, but it really isn't. What's the best counter to a widow mine rush in TVT? <laughs> this guy is for a trick doing the new patch hits. Are you seriously asking? You just have to play around it? Yeah. How to Zerk rush? You have to distract the enemy, and when he doesn't expect that, bam, you rush. New patch updates. Okay, round for that one, right? But I still get. Yeah, dude. Reddit is somehow it has recall. Give it crow earlier already. You know, would be kind of sick. New patch update. Okay, we'll I have a look. You suck, and I do too. Here we go. What people are starting to forget is that the problem of PVT is at the highest level only, above 6k plus. Not even above 6k plus, man. Above like 6'4". There's no problem even in GM and lower. In fact, there are a lot more Protoss players in GM than Terran or Zerg. This subreddit has somehow has come to the conclusion that Widow Mines are the bane of your existence. Yeah, dude. This subreddit is, uh, is not the best place to discuss balance, genuinely. I think a more charitable read is that some units are just not fun to play against. That is a lot more reasonable. Yes. Saying that sort of stuff, I don't have any problems with. But whenever people are like, you know, giving very precise 
balance suggestions, but they don't even really understand the game. That's when it kind of grinds my gears a little bit. Why don't mappers make cool maps that aren't all the same? Make something new, like st a stasis, a redshift? This shit is awful. Oh my, oh my god, insta veto. Yeah, no, this is very true. The clown council? Oh god. This guy, by the way, nicknames? This guy, by the way, has posted some really dumb shit. I was talking about some really dumb shit. Dumb. I was starting to pay attention to some people's nicknames, and this guy, River HS, is like one of the top tier clowns on this subreddit, man. This guy posts some of the dumbest takes on the balance patch that I've ever seen, but I haven't seen this one yet. Uh, Overcharge nerf, Disruptor nerf. Protos players are just worse, but we will buff the race, Pinky promise. Disruptor nerf, Hydra nerf, Cyclone buff. Mega Cyclone buff, Void Ray nerf. This is what I mean, dude. This guy is not even taking into account half of the really big edges that Protoss gets with the proposed patch, but doesn't even bring up the ghost. Happy What's going on, September. infested? Ghost. Yeah, 31 month reset. Yeah, this post completely ignores the massive ghost nerf, bailing nerf, lurker nerf, infester nerf. Yeah. So actually, uh, let's have a quick little look then. Oh yeah, I saw this one. The actual current patch looks like. If this post was pinned. The damage has been basically slight. Z, thank you so much. Welcome back. What is going on? Original Star. UNN Studios on Core Hall. <laughs> this is why. I, I really like that. Were you the one that just made those memes? That welcome back. And there's no back legend. Yeah. <laughs> this there we go. It's like Lost Temple. It really is like Lost Temple, dude. That's insane. Can you fit a Nidus worm there? <laughs> this is this is great. This is really nice. Oh no no no! I can fit three in there. Okay, I can put yeah. <laughs> this seems like an insane mechanic though. You could definitely put. I would just have to reload. Can lurkers reach that? I'm gonna have to take a screenshot for Twitter. No, no, okay. Hope it's not big enough first. Uh, let's see. No! Where? Land units in Black Lotus. Black Lotus. Can land. The map is going to make. It's. The high ground perch at the natural is. Misty infested. Like, really bad map. Yeah, so that's the really large one, right? I'm a ladder hero and I'm blah, blah, blah. You can drop units. Black Lotus is a really bad map. Yeah, so that's the really large one, right? I'm a ladder hero and I'm blah blah blah. You can drop units there. The map is going to make it's the high ground perch at the natural is landable. You can land what? <laughs> hold up, where is hold up? Let me let me find Black Lotus. Black Lotus. You can land units in the little high ground that's overlooking the natural. Wait, where? Here? No! You can land the siege tank? Okay, I gotta check this out in game. Cause that sounds horrible. Um but if ready for dust off. Okay. <laughs> no. This is what it feels like to play against Taryn. Okay. Okay. <laughs> no. Oh no. <laughs> Hold up right now. How many can I fit in there? How did you get out? <gasps> what? I'm gonna have to take a screenshot for Twitter chat. I gotta get my interactions for this month. Okay. Um, um, I thought we decided that, um, this was a bad idea in, like, 2011. <laughs> we had a map where you could do that exact, and, uh, it was, uh, very quickly decided that it was not great. Here we go. 
that it was not great. Lurkers, I would just have to uh, put or remake this lobby thing. We can have a. You could definitely put two siege tanks and build a turret. Can lurkers reach that? I just have to reload or remake this lobby thing. We can have a quick, quick little peek. You could definitely put two siege tanks and build a turret. Easy. Yeah, yeah, for sure. <laughs> this seems like an insane mechanic, though. The fact that you can... The fact that you can fucking... Okay. You can... <laughs> okay. You can... Okay. I guess I can put... Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna... I'm gonna make one more. I think I can probably put four of those things in there. Question is, is it gonna be in range? <laughs> Lurker's too big? Interesting. Oh, no, 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 I can fit three in there, okay. <laughs> this is, this is great. This is really nice. Yeah, big, big fan of that. Um. Okay, I've got some screenshots here. Um. So this is one of the maps that is proposed to be in the next map pool. And um, I don't know. I I haven't really checked out any of the maps, but um, it does seem a little shaky. It's like Lost Temple. It really is like Lost Temple, dude. That's insane. Can you fit a knight as well? worm there? <laughs> I mean. I guess. I don't know why you would want to put a Nidus Worm there, but you could you could fit a Nidus Worm there, yeah, I guess. What if I make six Hydras and I morph them in on the cliff? That's a very strange request. But I see what you're trying to say. What's going on, Shiny? Hello, hello. hello. Thank you so much for your resub. Appreciate you. Okay, I can put six Hydras here. I feel like I can fit more. Yeah, I can fit more. I gotta get my social media cloud going here in a minute, guys. Oh, there you go. Alright, alright. I guess this will do for now. Screenshot number one. Or I guess technically screenshot number three. They're not doing social distancing, no. <laughs> oh, no, you can't burrow them all. You cannot burrow them all. That is not possible. But you can make them. This this does feel a little bit cursed. Yeah, yeah. I guess I guess you can uh, at the very least, you know, get some additional uh, reinforcements going. That would be that would be something. All right, I gotta post this on the Twitter machine, or I mean X. All my homies love X. What's going on, Sagittarius? Thank you. All my homies love X. What's going? On? Gifting a community sub to Psycho? Hell yeah. Black Lotus. Should I include somewhere that it's likely that it's gonna be part of the, the thinking emoji? How do you do that? Is, uh, yeah, is, uh... No, you can't... To clarify. You can technically... There we go. It's likely that it's gonna be part of the new map pool. The next map pool. <sighs> Can I do the thinking? Um, oh, at these as well. You can technically you can technically fit a whole lot more lurkers on the high ground. Uh, can't burrow them all. <laughs> this is insane, dude. The fact that this is possible is, uh, 
It's something. Yeah, yeah, that is, uh, yeah, is, uh, yeah, it's not, no, it's not great. I'm not, I'm not gonna lie, that does not look great. There you go. On TikTok. Tick TikTok. I feel like I haven't told you guys that I am a TikTok superstar. I told you guys that I'm a TikTok superstar. I do have a TikTok account? Yes. Have I? I do have a TikTok account? Yes. Have I told you guys that I'm? I feel like I haven't told you guys that I am a TikTok superstar. <laughs> I have two thousand followers, chat on TikTok. Tick tick. Talk. All my videos get about 500 views, and then this one has 1.1 million. Why does this one have 1.1 million? What's 1 million? Million. Why does this one have 1.1 million? What's going on? All of them get like 300 views. And then this one has 1.1 million. Oh, jeez. What? Mate, how fast would that go? Do you think it's about me making a roller coaster during a sponsor stream. Yeah. So it's really weird, right? Here's, okay, let me plot for you guys. TikTok, right? Okay, okay, let me, let me try, let me try and give you guys a little bit of info, right? So this over here is time, right? So this is time. And this is views, right? I'm gonna... There you go. Don't know why I did it. <laughs> Don't know why I did it like that. Anyways, here's normally how these things go, right? So the red line over here is gonna be YouTube. So usually YouTube views originally obviously start at zero. And they kind of go up like this very quickly. And then they kind of taper off a little bit, right? So this is kind of how views usually go on YouTube. So initially you get quite a few and then, it, you know, you get a couple here and there. Right, yeah, it's it's a, fla a very flaccid curve. Well, well spot the CTG. It's a, um, yeah, it's very grounded. Anyways, uh, I don't know what color I should pick for TikTok. I guess I'll, I'll go with uh, purple. Yeah. Okay, that's not a very good color. This one. Yeah, that's much better. Here's how this video went on TikTok, right? So this 1.1 million views is where it's at right now. It started off getting absolutely no views, and then, you know, it got a couple. And then it suddenly spiked to 200k. And then it got a whole lot of nothing for a while, and then it spiked to 800k. And then it got a whole lot of nothing, and right now it's going up slowly? How, how does this make any sense? How am I supposed to create any sort of... How, what do I, how does this work? It makes no sense. The algorithm really is a bit of a meme. Yeah, yeah it's really strange. Because like it was stuck at like 500,000 and then at and then at 200,000 and then at 800,000 and now it's getting views again. It's, <laughs> it's the TikTok staircase. <laughs> the optics are the ticks and the flats are the talks. This is the tick, talk, tick, talk. <laughs> maybe maybe that's how it works. Yeah. Maybe maybe that's how it works. Yeah. What's going on, Fogline? Thank you so much for gifting us. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You should do a YouTube short. I posted a few YouTube shorts on my main channel. This one is getting more views now. The perfect surround. This is old. Yo! Get out of my uh, Wordy's channel. Is when I finally hit the. <laughs> and uh, I'm just played my first ladder game in two months. What a fucking letter game. It wasn't even. And this morning at four in the morning. Uh, I'm just for the 75 months. Idol is 14 player. One final cup this morning. And you saw this. Oh god. There's a burglar in your room. You woke up this morning and you saw this. Oh god. There's a burglar in your room. Yeah. One final fantasy 14 players. Damn. Yo, light switch. And five thousand dollars immortalizing their MMO character with a lifestyle uh, a life-size bronze statue. I kind of feel like this title is written like they're shaming him. This is cool, dude. What do you mean? This guy made a statue of his Final Fantasy XIV character. It cost him four hundred.
150 hours and five thousand dollars. That's super cool. I don't know how much uh, bronze statues usually are, but I feel like bronze statues are very expensive. Yeah. Yeah. Guys spent money to make art. What a fucking loser, am I right? Just sit inside and watch television and drink beer like the rest of us, you fucking idiot. <laughs> Man is a hobby. Art of 2023, am I right? <laughs> Man is a hobby. Fucking loser. <laughs> 23, am I right? Guy spent money to make art. What a fucking. Guy spent money to make art. What a f fucking. Loser, am I right? Sit inside and watch television and drink beer like the rest of us, you fucking. Of us, you fucking. Fucking. fucking Idiot. <laughs> so Man, Man is a fucking loser. Fuck. Fucking loser. A hobby. Fucking loser. <laughs> Art of 2023, am I right? Supposed to be. Does it no, no, I was talking about a real life stuff. Install games. I swear we don't have that much shit, but. <laughs> Way easier to keep track of. Very good at that. Oh, what? Oh, what? This guy is a fucking... This guy is a fucking... This guy is a fucking... <laughs> he trapped me! <laughs> I didn't even know my Zerkings could get trapped over there. That's amazing. Half of my links got trapped there, somehow. How is that possible? Did more of them die? My Zorklings are stuck. Yeah. Help me step Zork- no, 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 no. We do not need any help, chat. I'm a strong, independent Zorkling. Not really want to give you this bait. Come on, Bally. Bally, I just said the word stuck. Why? Uh, it's a perfectly normal word. Oh, no. And I didn't know that this was honestly possible. So he just. Fine, I'll remove it from. So he just. Stood there waiting to finish it off. And I didn't know that this was honestly possible. <laughs> what? Yeah, that must have been the group of Zerklings over here that I looped up before they were allowed to uh, leave the spawning pool. Strange. Very, very weird. They got all wiggly there, man. I was trying to figure. I was trying to figure out why half my links weren't on the other side of the map, and I couldn't find them here. Hmm. I don't know if he thought this was BM, actually. I actually thought it was a really cool move, but... I would have assumed more Zerklings died there. I think no, none of them died. We've been fed lies. Most streamers lie about being higher ranked, not lower ranked. Oh. I've been doing this wrong all this time, the Swiss. It is what it is, dude. Mm-mm-mm-mm. 
uh, you know, treated their older peak of hours on that game, they eat the bad experience. I mean, the sale is still obviously. Gabe, do you have one of these things running around that your stop is too dull? What is V pet? What is this? Oh god. What is V pet? What is this? Oh god. This game just came out? Ooh. -ooh. Feeling like the computer desktop is too dull? Need something cute to heal oneself? Come and try this new completely free and open source V pet simulator. Oh, f oh god. Is this one of those things that just walks around on your desktop? I remember that in like 1998. Gabe, do you have one of these things running around in your monitor right now? Be honest, Gabe. Watopia, what about you? Memory? Hello? This looks pretty awful, though. <laughs> yeah, it really doesn't look great. But maybe it's fun, I don't know. Your GPU would melt? Good, good, yes. This doesn't look like a GPU melter, I'll be honest, but... Overwhelmingly positive, man. I guess I have a daughter now. Time to buy milk. Casually sleeps in front of the crosshair. Finally someone that likes my music. No way this Chinese malware can't be this cute. <laughs> yeah, it is a little fishy, isn't it? She slept literally two seconds after I told her to study, just like me. <laughs> the only girl I'll have in my life. Interesting game, guys. Interesting game. You can download this for a friend, sure. Ten high though. That's actually pretty high. And sure. Tenth highest rank though. That's actually pretty high. Team Fortress 2 has been killing it for so long, hasn't it? Imagine if Steam actually cared, or if Valve actually cared about Team Fortress 2. Maybe they recently did a patch or something? I guess they did actually. I feel like they haven't cared about that game in a long time, but... Queen? Being a mammal? Facts. Um... Facts about... Platypus... But, but, pl um, ah, here we go. Eight interesting platypus facts. They're venomous. <laughs> of course. They give sharks a run for their money, at least as far as their electro reception is concerned. They use electronic impulses to detect underwater prey and locate objects in the darkest depths of the creeks and rivers they call home. What the fuck? Platypus's electro reception is concerned. They use electronic impulses to detect underwater prey and locate objects in the darkest depths of the creeks and rivers they call home. What the fuck? Fuck? What the f***? Platypuses lay eggs? Despite being a mammal, they lay eggs? They're overdressers? With two layers of fur for insulation and waterproofing, platypuses use their fur to trap a layer of air next to their skin so they can remain buoyant and dry when they're underwater. What the fuck? What the f***? Fuck. What is this animal? Why does it exist? How did it make it so far? 
This, this I think is the main proof that Australia is not real, guys. Like, it really does look... Like, this is some sort of, I don't know, like a very large hamster, and they just put a beak on it, like a plastic beak. It doesn't quite look right, you know? This looks photoshopped. They're cute, but they're babies. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> that, is, uh, that is something. That is something. That's, that's a look, dude. I might get banned for having this on stream. I don't know. They're even harder to spot now than they used to be. They're real? Mm. Are they, though? That's insane, dude. This is a cool-ass animal. It really does look photoshopped to me. Thank you, Secretarius, for gifting a sub to Kazijun. Thank you. They live in Australia? Right. People originally thought the platypus was a fake animal. An illustration of the platypus, yeah. When the platypus was first described in 1799, uh, so accurate is the blah 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 blah. Uh, so accurate is the blah 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 blah. The plat yeah. A duck's bill and feet on an otter's body and fur. It really does feel like a like a hoax, yeah. Venomous egg laying mammals. Extinction. Well that's that are at the fur uh, the, the the risk of extinction. Well that's that's most people, I guess. Or not people, animals. They have ten sex chromosomes? What? They have five pairs? Other still is that some of the, those Y chromosomes share genes with sex chromosomes found in birds? What the fuck? Fuck? What the? They don't have stomachs? They nosh on bottom dwelling, okay, invertebrates like worms? Insects? They don't have a sack of digestive enzymes? I, <laughs> I mean, I've never thought of my stomach like that, but... One possible reason for this is that these bottom dwelling dishes can be high in calcium carbonate. Okay, no need for acid if you're canceling it out all the time. They don't have teeth? They see with their bills underwater with those, I guess, electric things? Oh my god. This animal- yeah, <laughs> that is a weird-ass animal. That might be the weirdest animal in the entire world. Is there a stranger animal than the platypus? I can't- I- I don't know. Humans are a lot more normal compared to- Humans are a lot more normal compared to other animals out there, okay? It's- <laughs> It's- <laughs> My my copy paste a sack of digestive enzymes. No 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 no. Is there an animal on planet Another Earth? Another weird fact is that apparently they sweat milk. They sweat milk. What? Thank you, Mahans, for the three years. Hell yeah. Is there an animal on Earth that is stranger than the platypus? Strangest animals. Okay. However, here we go. There are other animals that could be considered even stranger than the platypus, depending on your criteria. The blobfish is a deep sea fish that has a gelatinous body that can withstand the high pressure of ocean depths. It is voted the world's ugliest animal. The narwhal is a whale that has a long spiral tusk. Right. Axolotls are cool too. Yeah, you know what? Axolotls are also weird. The star-nosed mole is a mole that has a ring of 22 fleshy tentacles around its nose? What? Oh, uh, what? Star-nosed mole. Ha! Ah! What the fuck? What the fuck?
What anime is this thing from? What the hell? That is one insane looking animal. They're blind? Yeah, I get that. That foot. The eye eye is a lemur that has a long, thin middle finger that it uses to tap on trees and find insects. Aye aye, Captain. Oh yeah, these guys have really long middle fingers, right? Yeah, 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 we've seen those. That is one creepy looking animal ant, dude. <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> I don't like that thing at all. Axolotls are cool. Yeah, no, I will give you that. A species of salamanders. Yeah, these these things, aww. They look kinda cute. Yeah, these do look kinda cute. Yeah, so those are its gills. They're like, like you know, fucking long outs. They're like, you know, fucking long. Lungs are outside of their body. I don't think that's a good place to keep them. Like, if I had to choose a location to keep my lungs, I would put them inside the body. Because I feel like that would be a good place for it, because it's better protected. <laughs> you think they chose? Yeah, 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 definitely. What's going on, Jira? Thank you very much for the reason. They've probably been on Earth longer than you humans. That's true. The star-nosed mole. What a weird fucking animal. It can detect and eat food faster. What a weird fuck. What a weird fucking. Animal. It can detect and eat food faster than any other mammal in less than a quarter of a second. Oh, that links to the platypus again, though, so I don't know how accurate this is. What's going on, Freckles? Hello, hello. Oh, you changed your nickname? How accurate this is. I'm gonna make a little note, though. Not comment. Dude, is that your beard? Sorry. I wish I could grow a beard that cool. Best. Let's do the... Baldur's Gate. Gina, what does the scouter say about his... P a wiener, please tell me... Ruby Blonde? This is for children, I guess. Hagelslag, Hagelslag is normally eaten. Oh yeah. Anyways, I don't quite understand that part, but dinner. It's actually dinner. Not the British tea where you got that. Ryan. He's having strope waffles for lunch. I don't quite understand that part. Oh yeah. Hagelslag, Hagelslag is normally eaten on bread. Hagelslag. This is a, a very common Dutch. Breakfast for children, I guess. Yeah. I used to have this as a kid all the time. Literally. Sorry, I didn't mean to video. This video, I don't know how many Americans there currently are. There's probably, it's probably a bit early. Guys, I watched a video uh, on the greatest app yesterday evening called TikTok. Do you guys know TikTok? Hold up, let me see if I can find this. I, I make this this video this video I, I make this this video this video I don't know how many Americans there currently are. There's probably it's probably a bit early for an American qu question, but but I think there's a few Americans tuning in right now, so we're probably good. Guten Mittag, Mr. Streamer Lowe's. What is going on, Kyle? Thank you for the 18 months. A wiener, please tell me whether or not this is accurate. I'm making sandwiches for my boyfriend and I because we're going on a hike tomorrow. And as I'm doing this, it occurred to me that French people do something very weird with sandwiches that I think you guys would find strange. So I wanted to share it with you. Um, this is butter. So obviously I have an entire half a baguette, obviously. Um, and what they do, it's like a classic sandwich. It's ham, cheese, and butter. Literally just swab it on. No mayonnaise, no mustard, just butter. <laughs> And listen, I know you might be thinking that sounds gross. It's actually so good. Is it healthy? No, of course not. 
Look at all that. So I'm going to butter these babies up. And then I just put um, amon a mental amontel cheese and jambon de pays, so ham. And that's, that's, that's what we eat. That's what we eat over here. Butter sandwiches with ham and cheese. <laughs> when, you, when you think about it, it's kind of crazy. Like, obviously, mayonnaise is basically fat as well. But, like, at least there's some flavor. And it's good, dude. It's good. Don't, don't ask me. Don't knock it till you try it, okay? Go get yourself a baguette, a real baguette. Grab some butter. Butter that baby up. <laughs> Throw some ham and cheese in it. Oh, God. Okay, that's... Do you not butter bread in the United States? It, please tell me if this is a thing. Buttering bread is considered weird? Is she trolling? I can't figure it out. If she's trolling, she's brilliant. If she's trolling, she's doing a lot of traction, because it's a very smart thing to get a lot of traction, because obviously the algorithm will pick this up, as a lot of people are going to interact with it. She has to be trolling, right? Okay. Maybe she just lives somewhere in the middle of nowhere in, in America. That could also be. But the fact that buttering bread is French culture, I came across this yesterday. Hashtag Parisian. <laughs> Parisian spelled like... Anyway, um, I feel like it has to be a troll. Um, I feel like it has to be a troll. It ha yeah, okay, okay. I, I just That's wanted all. to make sure that we are aware of this, because it does seem a little bit crazy to me, but I had to share it with you guys, because it seemed so far out there. That is so funny, though. I thought for a second that buttering bread was considered to be a, um, a non- American thing. I was like, huh, that's... I, I mean, it could be. It could be. My dad considered to be a, uh, a non-American thing. I was like, huh, that's... I, I mean, it could be. It could be. My dad does butter with ham. But he eats anything? Wait, what do you mean? He does butter with ham? On a sandwich? That's super normal here. Slice of bread, butter, ham. Super normal. Like, 100% normal. Just butter with ham? Really? Here. Slice of bread, ham. Just butter with ham? Really? Butter with ham sandwich? Wait, that is weird? Is butter with ham weird? You've never seen butter on sandwiches? Interesting. So there is a little, little bit of truth in that video somewhere. Butter on bread by itself, no meat. By itself, no meat. That is a bit strange. Just putting butter on bread, I, I, yeah, I don't see that being a thing, but... But butter with ham? That doesn't sound that weird. I mean, yeah, butter with bread, I guess, is just toast if you toast the bread first. That's fair enough. Hmm, interesting. Anyways, guys, I had to share it with you. Thank you, by the way, Bunny Warren, for the tier 3 resub. Big boy resub. Appreciate it. Bulletproof coffee is coffee with an entire stick of butter. Oh, shit. Bulletproof. Oh, sh shit. Bulletproof coffee? Oh no. Bulletproof coffee recipe. Bulletproof coffee is, is a high quality blah 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 with carefully selected fats. Is this some sort of keto coffee? It sounds like keto coffee. What do you need? You need coffee, oil, and ghee. Ugh, I don't like the sound of that. I mean, to be fair, the butter also sounds a bit funky. But, hmm. Interesting. So you just put a stick of butter in a in a in a cup of co coffee, basically. <laughs> this might be putting. Some yeah, yeah. Off. It sounds like a keto thing, right? Oh, she's gonna put an egg in there too. What about the protein? That's the only thing I care about. So she has a stick of butter. She has a stick of butter. 
or not a stick of butter. She has like a little bit of butter and then coffee and then an egg. I don't think in the Netherlands we're supposed to be eating eggs raw, but I know in a lot of places they do like go. heat up the eggs, I think, to basically kill any sort of bacteria. What about the rest? Ah, no, she threw out the rest. Where did she, where did the rest of the coffee go? No, what did she? Anyways, um, I've got uh, just black coffee, Chad. That's what I have. Only in Italy do they eat raw eggs? Off, it's too uh, not really raw. Oh, it's bait. Okay, I was gonna say it's bait. Never mind, Loco. Back off. It's too early. See, I haven't had my coffee yet. I didn't realize the bait. An actual image of a colossus in a war prism. Excellent. <laughs> Zero space is like an interest. The juiciest fungals. You're eating balut. The juiciest fungal. Balut right now. Balut, I don't know about them, and that's basically it. <laughs> People, right? That, well, maybe. So, already. Dreadful. Okay. What's going on here? Hey, guys. That's the most lethal enemy I've ever found. Insane, dude. Can I try and pet you? Okay, okay, sorry, sorry. That's the most lethal. Hey guys, what's going on here? Why is there a lady dancing? You can her as much as you like. You keep scaring your ragged. My, my. I can tell such a wonderful pressure. Don't be shy. Um, should I use that enlarging potion? It might be, it might be time for the potion of, um, ogre strength. Yeah, maybe she can balance my checkbook. We'll have to see. Maybe that's the, maybe she's an accountant on the side. <laughs> what do you think, silly? Love, of course. Hot and vulgar with me, or sweet and sincere with my sister. Trust me, you don't want to miss my signature Meta Baranza <laughs> love trick. I don't trust anybody that says they have a love trick. Hot and vulgar, please. <laughs> this game is very horny. I want both of you at the same time. Whoa, dude. You two look uncannily alike. We are twins. Um. Um, I'm sure. Like. We are twins. You look uncannily alike. We are twins. Um, um, I'm certainly not hiring both of you at once. <laughs> we are quite accustomed to working with each other. If you change your mind. <laughs> Chat, out of curiosity. <laughs> ah, jeez, I don't know. I can show off this on stream. I am, I am gonna keep my finger over here on this button, okay? I should quick save. Even going to the brothel may require a dice roll, huh? I promise you, Loco, it's safe. He will require. In that case, you and I just going to be the person beside you. <laughs> what a world! <laughs> I never dreamed I'd be on the. I thought she meant Shadow Heart. But What's this? Has made the dire mistake of failing to sleep with me so far, and it's a mistake I have been aching to correct. 
What happened? Nah, if it's with him, not interested, bro. A shame. <laughs> but one of us will be ready for you. If... What happened? Nah, if it's with him, not interested, bro. A shame. But one of us will be ready for you. If you wish to have us. <laughs> oh. Hey, lads. Asterion wants the best for me. I am stuck with Asterion, apparently. Couldn't get us on you. I- I'm- I'm- I'm curious. Alright, alright, we'll see. $500?! Chat, that's a lot of dollars, man! Is this something we can afford? I am very afraid of what it's gonna show me. This way. We have a room upstairs over yonder side. Oh, I actually have to follow her. Okay, I thought that would be a cutscene. Bro, I don't know how far this game goes. You cut both for 500? You cut both for 500? You guys, how do you know these details? Yeah, do you think an STI might be able to kill the worm in our brain? I just got scanned. Oh no, I thought she left. You read about it in a gaming magazine? Ah, yeah. I love gaming magazines. A tadpole prevents me from getting syphilis? I don't know. Taking me, dude. What is this? Look. Look, you didn't sign a treaty permitting you to march a war band through my lands. Lads, you gotta wait outside. I, I just have the whole party following you along. You, you guys, I'll be back in a tops. You came. I'm so pleased. You guys, can never tell who's going to get cold feet. I don't know. <laughs> so. Oh no. Here, what next? Bro, this game is kind of crazy, bro. All right, chat. No one picked three and one? Really surprises. <laughs> Somebody picked one. <laughs> Maybe she's gonna teach me the basics of C sharp. Experience no one to be embraced. But what that means is up to you. So what can I do for you? A tender touch. Sensory stimulation. Thank you, Panda Ninja. <laughs> Jesus Christ, this game. <laughs> Guys, I can't broadcast this. This is I- I don't know, guys. This- 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 I don't- I can't back out anymore. Don't worry, Loco, it's art. What do you mean by a chance to be embraced in the dark? It's all part of the experience. The room is bathed in total darkness, so there is nothing to distract from your ecstasy. Yeah. There's no judgment in darkness. No shame. Just a sensation of two bodies. <laughs> she might together. steal my kidneys. She, <laughs> she might. All right, let's have a sweet moment. My senses are yours to command. Or don't you want something wrong? God damn it, Chad. Okay, fine. We'll pull it. We'll pull it. I don't even need to pull it. I know what you guys are going to say. Like, I thought the in-game characters were horny, but... but...
<laughs> Just because I'm a drow, you think I've got a whip between my legs and a stiletto wedged between my breasts. As I'm relatively new to this business, unlike my brother, I'm not comfortable letting my <laughs> Jesus go Christ, too far. Jet. <laughs> Continue! <coughs> I'm sure Sorn will love you, though. He'll leave you wishing you'd asked for something tame. This is what- <laughs> Wait, no! You guys ruined it! I <laughs> Even in a video game, you got rejected! <laughs> Chet got too horny! <laughs> I lost 500 bucks, Chet! Sisadden won and just subscribed. <laughs> Just because I'm a drow, you think I've got a whip between my legs and a stiletto wedged between my breasts. As I'm relatively new to this business, unlike my brother, I'm not comfortable letting <laughs> my arms go Christ, too far. Jet. <laughs> Continue! <laughs> I'm sure Sorn will love you, though. He'll leave you wishing you'd asked for something tame. This is what- <laughs> Wait, no! You guys ruined it! I <laughs> Even in a video game, you got rejected! <laughs> Chet got too horny! <laughs> I lost 500 bucks, Chet. I, <laughs> I lost 500 bucks. Are you happy now? See, this is why I go against the chat's decisions for these polls all the time. We paid $500 to be rejected. Did I just get scammed? At least I still have my kidney. Did I just get scammed? At least I still have my kidneys. Yeah, and my virginity too, so that's nice. Shadowheart approves? Did it actually say that? <laughs> I'm gonna talk to the party outside. Hey guys. Oh. Wait, she's still here. Love, I'm utterly parched. Maybe buy me a drink in the bar? What are you- wh how? What? She- <sighs> Are you- be honest. What do you think of the new look? I love it. Well, I'm glad someone does. Get a stereo to pickpocket her? I might have to do that. Yeah. Here's what we're gonna do. Here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna talk with my dude. Oh no, I don't know if that works. Okay, a stereo. Ah, shit. I can attack her. I want my money back! No <laughs> Give me my money back! I want my money back! No <laughs> Give me my money back! <laughs> Excellent. She had... Dude! She had $12, now she's got 512. That was uncalled for, Loco? You thought that was uncalled for? Oh, I was gonna dump her out in the, uh... <clears throat> Breathe deep in the middle. 
<laughs> oh god, alright. I, um... Um, I don't know what I'd do with her. Okay, um, she's... on a life pretty hard. But I got my money back. I, I got my money back. <clears throat> Yikes. <clears throat> I tried pickpocketing, but that wasn't a possibility. Am I the bad guy? Hey. Do you think there's anything in this room? Anyone caught pleasuring themselves in the library will be tethered to the book chains of j Okay, no, 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 no. A surgical bed? What the heck is this place? A music box? A soap bar? A strapped choker. So tight. A black flare leather outfit. A minimalist leather binding that clings to the skin and creaks just the slightest bit when you move. All right. Well, at least we didn't come for nothing. Excellent. All the lads to wear it. <laughs> Excellent. Very good. Very good look. Lads, enjoy. Okay, that's helpful. A glass distillation. The warrior. He's getting worse. The whisper is getting rejected in a <laughs> thirsty game. That's so. F mm -mm -mm -mm. Okay. What a thirsty game. Enjoy. What a thir thirsty game. So funny though. Getting rejected in a. <laughs> For being too thirsty. Even the even the Baldur's Gate developers were like, yo, bro, this goes a little far. Do you think um I should go talk to her brother? Oh. Good morning, everyone. How goes it, logo? <laughs> whoa, 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 bro. What the f what did I just walk in on? Beautiful. More than beautiful. Stretched across the north sky, the golden dunes swim. You are the fruit of the forbidden palm. Oh my god, Chet. No, we're not gonna do this. We're gonna. No, 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 no. Oh, I just got in here. Okay, okay. The nymph through the flaming fists, hungry eyes. Your muscles shiver when. Guys, I just found a key and I just opened a door. That's all I did. What are you? Wait. I know you. Uh, whoever you think I am, uh, you're mistaken. We're not picking two, Chet. Bro, is she? This is my first ever brothel experience, guys. Is it normally like this? Because I, I find I find all of this a little strange. Where do we go from here? But like maybe this is how it norm. This is pretty standard. Okay. Hello. You okay? So just to clarify, if I didn't have the nudity setting set the way I have, this place would have looked a little different, right? Oh, not actually? Oh, okay. One word. Yuck. So the critics have said it Oh, okay. One word. Yuck. So the critics have said of Faerun's greatest masterpieces. I'm not so cold-hearted, nor so short-sighted. Oh, okay, okay. Your gaze intensifies. Your breath quickens and your heart skips a beat. The woman's senses are heightened and her fires... I thought she was just gonna maybe be like, yo, thanks for saving my life. But she's straight back to business, huh? The creature aroused you? What? 
the fuck? No, I'm out. What the fuck? No. No, I'm out of here, man. <laughs> I'm done here, bro. I am so done in this place. Be well, be beautiful. Oh, all right. All right. Um, I recommend that to you too, chat. Be well, be beautiful. Thank you, Arctix, for the 59 months. Welcome back. Chat, be well, be beautiful. I just, I just want to go talk to the other lady. Oh, they have a little bath. I just want to go. Hey, Raphael, my man, how are you doing? Yeah, there might She just like fucking like Discover you Oh when so what You know what guys I think fight characters in the sewers Speak with Raphael on I would like to just go. Is it? Yes, and before I once again get stuck in the middle of an engagement, which seems to happen every five steps I take. Let's refresh all of our spell points. Oh god, something happened. Let's refresh all of our spell points. Oh god, something happened. My beard is glitching out. What's happened this time around? They say that home is where a person can be their truest selves. Bro, put on a shirt! Jeez! Why are you naked? What if the Githyanki would invade it? Now that you have seen where I come from, Is this- is this one of the romance options? I myself on completion of my first adventure. The garments with which I concealed and later constructed my appearance as the Emperor. I am morbidly curious. We spoke of my relationship with I'll be honest. Lynn Stillman. We have talked. <laughs> no one else. I have no more secrets for you. We are true allies now. Resort. What if he accidentally uh, eats my brain in a moment of passion, Chet? Would that be a problem? I r you really don't sound like a mind. You really don't sound like a mind flayer. Just let it happen in that case. Yeah. Needs. The only way we were ever going to get close Fashion of crimes. To this <laughs> would trust a mind so I did what I had to to convince you. I studied you. Your motivation. Like I don't know if you guys have noticed, but my my desires. dwarf is also starting to grow out I his own tentacles. The best way to He's only got three little 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 thingies right now. Oh. You see that? Here's one little like look, I'm I'm starting to grow them out. We're, we're, you know, I, I'm trying my best. He did catfish me, yeah. He said he was a beautiful elfish girl, and it turns out it's it's this uh, tentacle thing. But, um, you know what? I consider that a, a perk. But, uh, um, you know what? I consider that a, a perk. I, I don't think that's, like, if, if, is it still a catfish? If it's even better? It's, it's a reverse catfish. Like, maybe, may, if he would have looked like this on the pictures, and then we would have gotten there, and it was a beautiful girl instead, then it would have been a catfish. Yeah. Clearly. Uh, yeah, it is vibrating a little bit. I don't know if that's a bug or a feature. It's pulsating. It's, it's making some, some movement. It's I only the one on the top right of his face. It's only this one. Mate, your tentacle. What I didn't it's like not a catfish, he was smurfing his Tinder account? Oh, you well 10 out of 10 pretending to be a 6? I could have done with a little more coddling. I didn't get that impression. <laughs> I'm not sure. Okay, alright, sorry. I'm glad I got the nudity setting the way I, I have it set up, man. I feel like he would be butt naked. Or tentacle Sometimes, naked. 
I feel, I feel like his tentacle would be dangling. Dancing away towards something deeper. True. True. All right, chat. Is this something we want? Do we want to have? I have not slept with anybody in this game. Oh my god. There's a, a Steam achievement for sleeping with this dude? <laughs> what are we doing? Are we, like, in midair? <laughs> Alright, Chet. Lean in towards it. Take its tentacle in your hand and invite it in. Or pull away. You will never play this game. <laughs> I mean, you don't have to have sex with the tentacle, man. Can everybody be quiet? I'm trying. <laughs> Invite it in. What does that mean, chat? Okay, I'm gonna I'm gonna keep my finger on the out button just to switch to the out of scenes. I, okay, here we go. What what are we? <laughs> what? Oh no, he's gonna eat my brain. Did I grab the one that was vibrant? It's excitement. Pause a moment as a thought occurs to you. What is a man's mouth? It's the thing it eats your head with, dude. If this creature is a failed history, you could literally see it. My character is not very observant at all. No. Kiss the tentacle and hope that it's an erogenous <laughs> Just crush your fingers. Hope that. <laughs> Here I go. <laughs> oh, come, come, come on. No, no. Jeez. Get it off my screen. Oh, okay, he's done. He's done. He's done. He's done. He's done. Why are you guys all saying two? Do it again? Oh god. This is so weird. It's worse than the bear sex scene. <sighs> god damn it. What is going on? Can it end? Can it end? I'm done. I'm done. I'm done. Oh god. Chat! Um. I don't know how reasonable it is to broadcast this. Let's just say the tentacles are... going in multiple places. Oh my god. Loco, we can tell you if it's safe. We're having a very close moment. Um, one of the tentacles is now going around my shoulders and around my back. And it is trailing down um, the body of my dwarf. Now there's... Oh, God. Oh, we've gone away together. We've gone away together. Okay. I wasn't sure exactly how much it was going to show. <laughs> okay. All right. I, I, <laughs> are you naked? Oh, my God. Oh, dude. It was hard to tell where thoughts ended and feelings began. And now that you've connected, you can <laughs> <really> feel. <laughs> There's a leaf. <laughs> I didn't notice the leaf. There was. It seems that. Had oh shit! What? To share more than you would have liked with your companions. Whoa, whoa! I said I'd protect you from the absolute. That was a leaf. It's okay. It's like one of those Greek statues, you know, where like they didn't bother chiseling out the wiener Come. and instead they just put a leaf there. It's time to get dressed. <laughs> we have work to do. Oh, oh, whoa, 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 okay. Two business dead. Oh, jeez. Oh, good thing I switched away. What the heck? All right. The Elder Brain's hive mind has grown to monstrous. Loco, tell us what happened. Just say Everyone my dwarf is very hairy all over. It was intelligent before. More than I really needed to know. To cross the city. Ay, 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 ay. So was this all a dream or like what just I don't know. Did I get my spell points back? That's really all I was trying to do. It was in the dream realm, yeah. 
That was more graphic than I thought it was gonna be, even with the nudity filter on. So just to clarify, this setting on. Um, I don't know where it's at. I don't know. Anyways, there's a nudity setting that you can toggle off. Full nudity is on by default in this game. Oh, jeez. Cool, man. What's up, Roddy? I feel like we copied that one logo. Oh. It's Thursday the 7th. Very nice. I'm farming viewers with cats. Dude, that's it, man. This is the key to any sort of internet Thank you, guys. Inscape this entire week. You can smoke them in. Ooh, the StarCraft memes, guys. Any good StarCraft memes, guys? The main reason I bought Starfield? Ooh, this guy made the Brood War hype here. Actually, pretty cool. You can't smoke them in RuneScape 3? Oh, yeah, yeah. Guys, I think we should leave her alone. She's had a rough, rough life. Yes, my name is Widowmine. I lost my husband five years ago. Yes, I'm a widow. Nerf, don't you think? Oh, my God. In honor of the lukewarm launch of... You guys been enjoying Starfield at all? We talked about it briefly. It looks pretty generic for sure. Here it is. I think that's what he says. I'm not exactly sure. Oh my god. Banelings nerve real shit, man. They are built differently. This is actually they're in the no, they are upset. Yeah. Starfield is mid. Is it King Jaceman? Good to see. You. Maybe a little bit less um yeah. good change. Rock, paper, scissors. She tuned in at least a year and a bit. Mr. Potato Pro like potato. This is why I uh, don't know why that is on the Okay. I figured you'd... Oh. Okay. I uh, don't know why that is on the subreddit, but... Sure. Okay. Okay. I uh, don't know why that is on the subreddit, but... Sure. Micro like potato. This is why I'm not master. Float down the minerals, quote unquote, sick micro, gold league. It's got 103 comments. I'm sure these comments will be very reasonable. Let's have a quick little peek. I don't know what I expected. Yeah. Nuclear bonk detected. Who approved this? This fan base is too horny. GGG was right. Every gaming fan base is too horny, dude. I think, I think that's basically every gaming fan base. Such a good meme, dude. I'm, so, I'm glad that people are starting to fucking call people out. Yeah. I like, I like these type of memes. This is such a good meme, dude. I'm, so, I'm glad that people are starting to fucking, starting to fucking. To call people out. Yeah, I like I like these type of memes. The EU has fallen. Billions must Korea. The state of affairs. Does any suddenly public basically at the pro level? If you can type the whole word with just one hand on the left. Trying me. Great to enjoy Starcraft. Uh. You need a computer upgrade to enjoy StarCraft, but not enough minerals? Oh, this guy put a space between Star- That is the real crying me. Who puts a space- Do you guys know that? I can do a space guy seemed fitting for the protal sound. Not enough minerals. More probes. Construct additional pylons. Find second nexus. We're under attack. I can't believe this guy is disrespecting Mr. Paul like that. Okay, what is his name? That's- that's- I don't know why that is a thing. Better. I'm a fan of nice heck. <laughs> Brutals was going for a proxy over at the for the StarCraft subreddit. Or there's a temporary outage of the. <laughs> Seltzer and fancy spitting f during Gamers Eight. Hey fancy, when's the last time you saw a PVP match? It's been a while. We haven't seen one on stage so far. Am I right? Yeah, no, not on stage yet. So we'll check this time is Showtime and Hero. 
<laughs> this guy is really grasping for drama now. He's really... Did my account get bent? I'm behind Oh, years ago, I probably would have been... I rolled nice teeth. Let me see if your middle ear is working. Mate, I had braces for you. But, yeah. You know. Oh, God. But, yeah. You know. Oh, God. Let me see if your middle ear is working. Toad, Luigi, Bowser, and Wario were up to no good. They were playing a game called Toad Chalice and in the middle of them was a silver cup. The cup would hold the nut. But, whoever was the last to fill the chalice had to down the mushroom chowder. Okay. Bowser was the first to blow. Okay. <laughs> is this from Artosis' stream? Is there like a collection of these copy pastas somewhere out there? Or do people actually write these fucking things from scratch? Do people actually write these fucking things write these fucking things? these things from scratch i don't understand like where do they come from D are are there a bunch of starcraft gamers out there that spent the entire day writing mario erotica only for artosis to go live and then copy paste it into chat is this what guys are doing at work they're like writing fucking poetry they're like writing fucking Poetry? It's like a Mario fanfic. It really is. It is kind of amazing though. Because there's a lot of unique ones. He acknowledged it as poetry? Oh, absolutely. You write this from scratch, anti Writing he acknowledged it as poetry. Oh, ab so wait, do you write this from scratch, anti diarrhea? Because, like, the Artosis viewers really have nailed the TOS and where the line gets crossed, right? Because they know they know Artosis will skip it if it's you know a step too far. So they they have they have skated the line very nicely about what they can and cannot do. Yeah. It's kind of amazing. Work is work. I'm starting a fanfic union. There it is. Do you think um Bing can write me a uh, Mario fanfic? Okay, actually I was going to request it to write a Mario Erotica fanfic for me, but I think that might be a bad idea. That might actually cross the line. Not gonna do that. That could backfire real fast. <laughs> no, that's definitely a bad idea, Chad. You can do it if you want to. <laughs> you can do <laughs> Cross the line while Artosis is in the middle of combat. Artosis has got a foot pedal. He told me about the foot pedal that he uses to skip text-to-speech. Like, cause, cause people were getting clever about it, right? Like, they would write these really fucked up Mario fanfics, and write these really fucked up... Really fucked These really fucked up... Fucked up... They would write these really fucked up Mario fanfics and then donate while he was in the middle of an engagement. And he couldn't switch away and all tap out and all that to skip the donation message. So he got a foot pedal to skip the text to speech. I think that's what I ex uh, what he explained. I'm fairly sure that's what it came down to. So he's. <laughs> 
literally suffering from success. That's so funny, though. He's got this stream deck foot pedal. That's so funny. Motivation is driven by necessity. <laughs> you gotta get your other limbs out in order to skip. That's so good. He used it many times on you. It is kind of brilliant. Modern pro problems require modern solutions. <laughs> Mario Erotica causes technological advancements. Yes. Innovation is driven by Mario Erotica. And I think that's beautiful. What's going on, Gurgulus? 34 months, my dude, too. And I have to start looking. Oh, bring. Uh, not Donald Dick. Demonstrate. Twitch chat favorite. I will save it here. This is. Uh, now we gotta go and figure out a way. Excellent. Now we run to the. I could attack the chip. It's not like we can get any loot. For okay. Everybody to the ground. We free Volo. And most importantly, we don't touch anything. It's not like we can get any loot from these people that we are gonna. No, 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 Loco. What the heck? I could attack the chair. Okay, he glitches through the barrels. We save. Now we run to the to the to the to the docks over here. Okay, excellent. We save Volo. Excellent. Oh, okay. Uh, now we gotta go and figure out a way to get through here. Well, she's gonna be a Twitch chat favorite. I will save it here. This is where we'll continue next time. Figure out a way to get through here. Well, she's gonna be a Twitch chat favorite. I will save it here. This is where we'll continue next time. <laughs> In the previous episode. This is gonna be for next episode of Loco TV. Very nice. Thumbnail bait. All right, guys. Thumbnail bait. There it is, dude. Alright, guys. Hope you enjoyed watching today's stream. I'll be back again on Monday for one. If you are new here, hit the follow button so you get notified when I go live. You can always subscribe to the stream too by hitting the subscribe button. There's a bunch of different cool discounts you get right now. For example, because of September. There it is, dude. In fire, probably. <laughs> like, Harstam, you know, you can tell he's a pro. It gets us. You should. That's <laughs> so. Anyways, apparently, getting a cake to get her. Anyways, apparently, Geralt posted in Twitch chat. Is this the balance council? And I just. I, I think this is a glorious meme. I don't know why this hasn't made it to the StarCraft subreddit, because this is. This is so good. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> is this the balance council? This is so good. If you want free karma, you should you should definitely post this. That's so good. It gets a seven out of eight. I think this is a nine out of ten meme. Yeah, yeah. Because it's so good, especially as Harstam is like, huh? like Harstam. You know, you can tell he's a Protoss player just from uh, the positioning of his arm. You can tell. Portals players really do make it quite obvious. Anyways. StarCraft 2 or StarCraft Rotter will be 20. What is That is games. So 80 plus workers swarms. Ooh, that's a good point. Adepts are kind of like that obnoxious person that... Do you have a minute to talk about... Look at me. Exactly like... Look with death. Killing every franchise. We... Do you have a minute to talk about our Lord and Savior? Ooh, ooh, that's a good point. Adepts are kind of like that obnoxious person that keeps knocking on your front door because you opened the door once in 2019 out of error. You accidentally were nice to stranger people that were trying to convert you to their religion. And now they still show up. I had that at some point. Um, when we first moved 
moved in here in 2018. So a bunch of Jehovah Witnesses showed up at my house, and I was nice to them once. And then one other time, right, they showed up again, and I'm like, okay, I'm not really interested in talking. And then another time after that, I think a couple weeks later, I saw them parking right in front of my door, and they made a beeline straight to me. So, like, I was literally a name on a list, and they were just going door to door to the people that were nice to them. So I told them I'm not interested and that they should take me off the list. And they uh, they were like, oh, we don't have a list. Oh, but there's no such thing. There's no such thing. Anyways, I had to be a dick to people, even though I didn't want to be. Yeah. The alternative was in my living room and pretending I wasn't home, and I contemplated that for a little bit. But I, I'm fairly sure they saw me. So, you know, pretty sure they saw me. So, you know, I... This Terran gaslighting analogy for Terran. But then it turns out there's another. <laughs> I couldn't have timed it any better. <laughs> gaslighting analogy. Will this. This is uh, Mr. Rotterdam making a gaslighting analogy for Terran versus Protoss. Like tank dies and you have three more guys. Yeah, yeah. It's like as a Protoss, you get really hopeful. You're like, wow, my blink stocks are doing really good. But then it turns out there's another tank, and then you blink forward, but then there's a widow mine and two marauders, and you lose seven stalkers, and you're like, man, did the Terran just gaslight me into believing I could win this fight? <laughs> yes! That's absolutely what happened! Oh. <laughs> I couldn't have timed it any better! Oh my goodness! This is the greatest commentary moment of my life! <laughs> <laughs> it's very true, though. Protoss vs. Terran, man. Feels good, dude. <laughs> Home Story Cup reminded me. Is that supposed to be white rock? I guess. It's the like the story. Uh, Probe's actually good at the game. A long time ago. It's been at least five. Engagement fight. Once again, I'm not saying that. And I suck at playing. Healed her seven times. She's healed her. Do you think they're still? It's the. Here, I can't fly across. I mean, I definitely seen this. Look, have you seen this? Oh no, Gabe is linking something. Look, have you seen this? Oh no, Gabe is linking something. Ah! No, I had not seen it, and I kind of wish I hadn't. What's going on? What is this? Cute? This is cute? How is this cute? Oh god. Triv Hugo, hello wonderful people. Did you Lo switch the ears? A a a a a a oh god. Hello wonderful people. Did you Lo switch the ears? A a a a a a did you Low switch the ears? A -A 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 <laughs> you switch the ears between me and little Toby? I don't know about that one. I don't I don't know about that one. Oh god. Oh about that one. Oh god. Thank you very much, Kali Brovka. Thank you very much. Are you guys furry shaming me right now? Bro, it's 2023 chat, you can't do that. Hello. Keep cold out. Maybe the name of the keep is out. Keep cold out. Maybe the name of the keep is out. Graphic design is my passion. <laughs> I can tell. Do that, hello. Graphic design is my passion. <laughs> I can tell. I don't really want to go. No, I think what I'm going to do if I can fuck up. He is in. From there, right? I guess. For sure. It's very. Okay. You don't have permission to. Yeah. They look up to himself. To give you all <laughs> echo steel again and an AWOC off again. What does he say, chat? To give you all 
I looked at this and I couldn't figure out what was wrong. Pulling it off again. What does he say, chat, to give you all? <laughs> I looked at this and I couldn't figure out what was wrong. <sighs> Graphic design truly is your passion, isn't it? Thank you very much, Echo Steel, for the 82 months. He says, hi Lenny, I'm really glad that we have some words privately. I just admire how wise you are with all the great advice. He then also gave a sub to Echo Steel. Wait, no. <laughs> Sorry, I'm trying to read chat notifications and I'm looking at the screen all at the same time. Echo Steel gave a sub to himself. Wow. And then also to the Hunter. But yeah, okay. Thank you then also Awok and Ryan for... They look better. They look better on him. <laughs> you even scaled them a little bit. Pieces were never. You even scaled them a little bit to be more in line with my head. One thing that kittens have, at least our kittens always had, is that they were. Like their faces were never quite. Is this a normal thing for kittens? I feel like their ears are way too big for their face. Yeah. Looks fine. I feel like. I like his ears are still as big as they are right now, to be honest. Like, as they are in this picture, I mean. Obviously, Toby is much older now. Anyways, guys, um... Toby is much older now. Anyway, yeah... Maybe, I don't know. Oof, and he is very f Must have been, must have been. That is very large. And he, uh... Lower on Monday. Game Zork versus Terran is... Yeah, just don't do that. For example, right? Sometimes you'll be fighting a boss in that game, and you, like so, you know when you play the game and you make a mistake. But in the mind of a dark, and her timings are very whack as well, right? Like, Melania is a very difficult boss. But Sekiro being way harder. You're still getting your ass kicked by Melania. Six links here. It's a little too. You're still getting your ass kicked by Melania. Oof. I thought you were supposed to be a Sekiro god, Pete. Weren't you flexing about Sekiro being <laughs> about Sekiro being way harder than Dark Souls and all that? And now you're struggling on Elden Ring? <laughs> good, good, very good, very good. Suffer as we have suffered. I am Melania. Sword of Mikola. Hey Pete, hesitation is defeat. <laughs> Just don't hesitate, bro. Have you considered not hesitating? God. Really need to tell you everything here. You beat her with a Kamehameha? That's true. I did use both the Mimic as well as the Kamehameha. I used the tools that the game gave me. I know. That was a little lucky, actually. I'm kidding, though. Melania is a very, very difficult boss. The fact that she heals is so bullshit. So bullshit. It's so bullshit. Bullshit. <laughs> This is one of the hardest bosses in any Soulsborne game ever. And she has this vampiric ability where she heals every time she hits you. You're like, come on, Elden Ring. That was bullshit, dude. The answer is just bullshit. 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 Bullshit, dude. Bullshit. Dude. The answer is just don't get hit. Yeah, just don't get hit. And kill her before, you know, she kills you. It's easy. And her timings are very whack as well, right? Like, all of her abilities kind of hit at what seems like a random timing. It takes a long time to figure out. But she's an optional boss. So at least, you know, that's a thing. But in the mind of a Dark Souls player, 
optional bosses are only optional when they're easy. Just play like Serral, though. Yeah. yeah. Just, just don't fail. I mean, I feel like it's quite obvious, really. Like, so, you know when you play the game and you make a... Just don't... Like, so... So, you know when you play the game and you make a mistake? Just don't make... Just don't... Just... Just don't do that. For example, right? Sometimes you'll be fighting a, a boss in that game. And you'll find yourself getting hit. Don't. Very good advice, no? Homeless? Buy a house. Don't have money? Don't be poor. Welcome, guys. I'll be here all day. You didn't think of that? See? Think of that? See? You didn't yeah. Don't have a girlfriend? Just get married. Don't have a girlfriend? Just get married. I'm not enjoying those Ravagers versus Oracles, I mean. I do believe I'm winning. Sneak out around the drones. It's a dangerous round. I'm a Zerk bad boy. <laughs> In the middle of an epic fight against stalkers. I know. Look at me. Still winning the fight. Excellent. Love it whenever I go across the map from a player playing. Just wasted a lot of energy on killing my drones though. That's oh, was so sick, he blocked himself. Da, da, da. Yes! I have a Yamaha. That's my, that's this hand. That seems really good. So basically at the beginning, uh, <laughs> have a digital one, so you don't have to like tune. That kind of helps. It's the digital. <laughs> what is this? I have a yum. <laughs> what is this? Yo, I'm scrolling up in the Patreon group chat. How many veins do you want to have? Wait, why are you guys talking about my? God, that's a lot of veins, dude. What the fuck is he, my grand? What the fuck? What the fuck is he, my grandpa? Dude, what the fuck's going What the fuck? What's going on? <laughs> I don't know, chat! What part of that is? Is that's that's my right hand. That's my that's this hand, right? My hand looks no more normal on video now, okay? These are strong hands for old school RuneScape, yeah. These are gamer hands. Is Loco really playing RuneScape? I was playing RuneScape at Home Story Cup, yeah. God, it does look really cursed. Holy crap, man! I look like my grandpa. Well, when he was alive, anyways. Um, not ideal. I don't know what's going on, guys. But yeah, I am doing, uh, if you want to know where I am. Yo, can any Giga Chats in the chat actually tell where I am currently located in RuneScape? If you can tell where this is, I'd be very impressed. It is kind of hard to tell. Motherload mine? Yo! There it is! I'd be very impressed. It is kind of hard to take. Yo! There it is! Two gamers in the chat. Recognize. The Motherload Mine. It is the Motherload Mine. It really is. Um. Oh, there it is. Ah, this is what I'm trying to learn right now. Hold up, let me see. Oh, there it is. This is uh, Silver League Loco. I have a Yamaha. The digital one. Yo, I'm scrolling up in the page. It is uh, only a couple operations. Do you guys not have like veins in your hand? It's veiny hands. What's wrong with my hands? I don't know, guys. This is what I'm trying to learn right now. Hold up. Let me. Oh, there it is. 
Ah, this is what I'm trying to learn right now. Hold up, let me see. I started learning this. I started learning this, I think about two weeks ago. It is uh, only the first part of the song, though. This is uh, Silver League Loco. Legs? There are legs here, yeah. I like this song a lot. <laughs> it's just my hands. Anyways, practicing, making some. What's wrong with my hands? I don't know, guys. I have veiny hands, apparently. Do you guys not have, like, veins in your hand? It does look kind of cursed, dude. My hands do look a little cursed here. I have gotten a couple operations done. And I remember the nurse, whenever they, like, have to put the thing in your hand. I got a compliment on my hands at some point from the nurse because I was so easy to fucking stab with a needle. Because I was so easy to fucking... Easy to fucking... Stab with a needle. Yeah. Very easy, apparently, to, uh... They stabbed me right here. There's like this little, this little like, like this little, there's like this little, this little like spot where the, the veins join up. They stabbed me right here. There's like this little, this little like spot where the, the veins join up together. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe it's a StarCraft players thing. Pro gamers thing. I noticed this when- you know when, like, those- those pictures? Of like, the pro gamers, whenever they're at like, tournaments, and they always have the pro gamers stand there, like... Like, where they always stand like that, right? I always notice that the pro gamers have very muscular forearms. I think- I think a lot of StarCraft players probably have... Um... Yeah, probably some strange looking- hands as well. I wouldn't be surprised. It has nothing to do with the game they play? I think so. It's a lot of porn. Yeah, it's Starcraft. I think so. It's a lot of porn. Yeah, it's Starcraft players just, uh, you know, a lot of masturbating going on, so very muscular forearms. I can find a photo that I don't know what I'm talking about. Um, I don't know if I can find that. Uh, there's you this is kind of an example. We had these pictures, for example, from, uh, uh, I am Karavitsa. Like in this photo, Cyril's forearms are as big as his upper arms. I guess if this is forearm, that must be back arm, right? right? Anyways, there are there are more extreme variants of this, but I, I always, I don't know. If you pay attention to this, you'll probably notice it at some point at a StarCraft tournament. All the pro gamers for some reason have, well, not for some reason, but they have, uh, they're like Popeye, basically. Most pro players are pretty fit, yeah. They hide their veiny hands. <laughs> uh, okay, what music do we want to listen to? Thorn you were that. Well, let me take a moment to tell you all about our Lord and Savior, September. September. Town kicker. Thank you for.